All right, I'm down here again, and um, it's my first signal. It's a low tone. Let's see what it is. Nice low tone. All I can do is hope. Hope for the best. I just got here. Not yet, huh? Ah, uh, the bottle cap. Probably. Yep. <laughs> How about you? Just got here right there. Uh, okay. How you like that Equinox? Uh, I haven't really tried it that much. I'm just no? going to try it out today. Yeah, I've got a couple of things. I didn't think they love it. Alright, here's my second decent hit. First one was a bottle cap. This one's a penny. <laughs> I can almost bet. Deeper than that. Yep. In the scoop. It is a penny. Penny. I'll take it. I have my Equinox on my back. Um, figured I'd look for a spot with this one, and then if I find a spot, I'll do a video on how the Equinox works. But I did try it once, and I wasn't that impressed. It, uh, it gets a lot of signals that aren't even there and you have to mess around with other signals it's like they're it's not real sh a sure thing like it has numbers and everything but sometimes the numbers like if you have a small piece of gold like a chain or something it'll come up as a one um, and it, then it would be real shallow you just scoop and check and if it's deeper, it's supposed to have, uh, then it's not supposed to be anything good. But I don't know. I don't know if I want to mess around with all that. <laughs> so I like this one. It's a good, the Excalibur too. Um, it's every hit, I kind of can tell what the signal is going to be. And I don't even have numbers on this. I could, I mean, I could tell if it's a good target. The, the other one with those numbers, it got you guessing because it's all jumping around and you're like, oh, I wonder if it's good. And then you dig it and then you lose it. And then, oh, it's a pain. But uh, I'm sure I'll get used to it. And uh, hopefully we'll get some time in today because I'm not going to stay here. My Huntington. Uh, it doesn't look like it's very good. I thought it, uh, there, we have wind right now, so I was hoping it would like eat away the beach a little bit, but it didn't do much. I'll show you guys. About the same as it was. There's a little bit more slant, but other than that, pretty much the same. So I'll knock out this area here and then I'm on to another beach. One. Let's see what it is. Whoa. Can't believe what I just found. You won't believe it. A penny. Pretty cool, huh? <laughs> uh, I'm probably going to be heading to another beach real soon here. I did hit a little bit of a hot spot. But it was just junk. But I was getting targets, so that's always a good thing. Alright, I'm going to keep going a little bit longer. Alright, we're going to try in this bay here. And I'm going to use the Equinox. Um, there's a lifeguard I see. I hope they don't say anything. Anyways, let's get at it. Well, it turns out this beach isn't very good. But I did get a signal right now. That possibly could be a coin. Let's keep the sand nearby. Oh. 
Yep. Not a coin. It's a ring. A pull tab ring. Yeah. Keep going. Beaver tail. Pull tab beaver tail. Tired of getting signals over here. But so far, they haven't been good. I mean, they've been good signals. Fishing weight, beaver tail. Ah, uh, I got it. I was by the rocks, I didn't think I was going to get that one. Could it be my first coin? It is. And it's just a penny. But hey. Uh, I got a coin. I see more people showing up on the beach too. So I'm going to keep going. I mean it's easier to get nothing on this beach than it is to get on other beaches. Look at the sand. It's really hard. So I might as well just stay here and just see what I can maybe get lucky and pull something out. I just thought I'd show you guys, there's like oysters on these rocks. You can see where one was there, right here. The white spot. It looks like there's some real whole ones here. <laughs> so if I get hungry, <laughs> and I'm brave, I could eat some. <laughs> I wouldn't eat these. This dirty bay. I see a whole one there, and a couple of pieces here and there. There's mussels down on those rocks with another one there. So I'd imagine there's probably some more right in, in this rocky area here. Alright, I'm gonna keep going. One. Could be this little thing here. Nope. Got it. <laughs> it is another penny. This is an interesting sound. Really high. Probably just something big. It might be a couple of targets. You know what that means, if it's a couple targets, Probably a coin spill. Yeah. <laughs> Got it. I hear something clunking. Hey. Finally, I got a quarter. It's all green, though. Oh, it came off. <laughs> Let me make sure. Yep. It's a quarter. Let's dig the other thing with. <laughs> this is a lower town. I'm thinking that's why I had that weird sound, because it had two tones. I got it, whatever it is. Let's 
see what it is. There it is, I see it. Another green one. Ready to scrape some off. But it's the lower tone because it's a nickel. I'll take it. Hey duckies. Little ducks there. Can you see them? I want to come down and see what I'm doing. Hey little duckies. That one's kind of cool looking. It's got a blue head. Really dark blue though. I don't got no food. No food for you guys. <laughs> Maybe they're just going to go for a little swim. There's the female one and there's the male one. The female one's limping. Uh, she has a hurt foot. I think I got uh, what's left of a ring or something, maybe a belly piercing. I don't know. I'll have to take a better look at that when I get home. There's a stone there, but it's all corroded away, so it's probably really old. But I see gold on there around the edges. But it's probably just copper. Oh yeah, it came off in my hand. I have gold on my thumb. <laughs> uh, probably just a junker or something. Big sounds. See boy. I've got that on big silver rings before. That's why I always dig. I'm hoping for another one. Clunking is good. Uh, in a ring shape but it's some kind of thing I'm a digger uh, something off one of those boats probably those kayaks uh, I tried to blow the sand out and went right back in my mouth not good I just dug a dime now I got this signal And it's a penny, of course. <laughs> Low tone. I found a few of these. Oh no, that's a piece of jewelry. It's a little piece of jewelry. I see a diamond thing in there. Huh. Alright, I don't think it's anything good, but we'll check it when we get home. <laughs> that's cool. But I've been finding a lot of little snap button things. And tiny rings, little tiny rings. Like, I don't know what they were on, but... They are roughly on something, obviously. That's kind of cool to dig a low tone. And have it actually be jewelry. I just got a ring. It's probably junk. But hey, I'll take it. It could be gold. I don't know. Yeah, it doesn't look very golden. Well, oh, it says 14K right there. Oh my gosh, I got a ring. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, sorry. <laughs> That's pretty cool. How's it going? <laughs> Those things look heavy, but you guys just carry them right out of there. Yeah, 
Well, there it is. I didn't get too happy about it because uh, there were two guys getting out of the water right right when I got it. I was like, oh no. But yeah, I just wanted to show you guys. It does say 14K on it. Uh, right on that side there. I don't know. But I got a, a ring, whether it be gold or not, even though it says 14K, it's kind of light. But it is thin, so I'm thinking no, and it didn't sound have didn't have a low tone, it was high. I thought I was digging a quarter or something. But anyway, it's, it's a ring. Yay! I can make a video. <laughs> wow. No, I did just see another guy show up to metal detect, so this beach does get hit. And I got that in a, the ring in an odd place where most people probably wouldn't hit. I found that's the best thing to do because he's going doing the exact same thing I did when I got down here. That other guy's. So, well, now I'm going to try going in the water. I haven't tried in the water over here yet. But I figure I'd get out there and try to get some. Sorry, I'm not using the Equinox. It was a trick. I'm not going to use it today. <laughs> Pretty. I walked out here and right away I got a big hit. See if I can get it. I can't really see where to dig. I think I got it. It's probably just a big fishing weight or something. <laughs> oh wow. Look at how gross that is. I don't see anything. Well, let's take that baby up on the shoreline. So I don't see anything. Make sure it didn't fall out. Toss it up. Oh, I see it. <laughs> actually a pretty new penny if I hadn't been down there but a couple months if that everyone I figured I'd do a live dig I'm actually getting a lot of hits in the water here I'm glad I came out here I'm working for my money now clunky in a little bit oh I see it I had a feeling it was gonna be a penny but anyways that's what it is it's good I turned the camera on <laughs> I'm telling you uh, that's disgusting this penny there we go it's clean now I can't even see where I'm digging you kick up a cloud and it just spreads out. By the time you wait for it to disappear, it takes too long. It's real mushy out here. This is not the swimming area. I can tell. sound like a penny it sounds like junk but I'll dig it since I have the camera on but see I got that hit pretty quick It's not really easy digging, as you can see by the big old chunks I'm taking out. Uh, no. Yeah, it's just junk. Make sure. Alright. Gotta kick this back in the water, and I'll turn it on when I get a good signal, I guess. I don't know. It doesn't sound like a penny, so I'm going to dig it live. <laughs> well, 
might take a minute. This is not the easiest digging right here. But it is a fun hunt here. It's actually fun because you're getting targets. Alright, I'm actually going to take this one out. I found it works the best just to take it out. to be a piece of foil uh, I forgot that's what they sound like um, I've been pulling these clams out when I dig uh, these are two small ones but this one is the reason I started taping because this one's all white I guess that's how they are when they're babies uh, little clams Lots of them here. There's bigger ones too. Okay, I'm taping. But see, here's here's one of the bigger ones. But I think that little white one was a different kind. So I, I got all these in one scoop. Because uh, this was a, one of those white ones. And the lines go across this way on this one. And they, the lines go out on these. And this one might even be a different. No, I think these are the same. And then... uh that one, I don't know. Probably the same as these. I don't know. Might be two different kinds, I have no idea. Could be totally wrong. Could be the same kind. Anyways, they're making me hungry. Alright, I'm at my third location. Here's the first signal. Definitely sounds like a penny. It goes a lot deeper than I thought. Maybe it's not a penny. Ah, good. It's not. It's a quarter. <laughs> Yay! I'll give you a hint where I'm at. There you go. A little too high, huh? Pink. Let's see if we can get here. You see a real nice cut all the way down there. That doesn't mean anything for this beach. That's normal. Hey, this isn't bad. I'm doing pretty good. A couple quarters, a couple dimes, and another dime. I'll keep you guys posted on this beach if we get anything good. This, uh, this is what this cut looks like. Pretty nice. I'm just working it. I'm just doing the top part first, and then I'll, then I'll go down here. But the tide's coming in, so I'm kind of doing it in a rush. Alright, here's a low tone, but the last low tone I dug it was just a nickel, so it's probably just a nickel. No, it's kind of high. <laughs> Could be just a sloppy quarter. Uh... Nope, it is a nickel. Alright. Doing really good on the change. Well, I was really killing it over there. I was killing myself too. I only got two and a half hours on the meters, but man, I got a whole day's worth of coins. And then the tide started coming up and closing me in, so I moved to a different spot on the same beach. And this is my first signal. Well, actually, I pulled. I did a pull tab already. Second signal. On this side of the beach, the calm side. <laughs> of course, it's a penny. I just dug like 20 quarters, and <laughs> now I get a penny. Fresh drop, yeah. 
I just tried to dry for a minute and boom. A big old ring. Look at that baby. <laughs> I might be able to wear it. <laughs> I just figured I'd try to dry. And it worked. I should probably check the time. Fits my pinky. I'll wear it. <laughs> well, I think it's time to call it a day. We've got a half hour left on the meter. Um, I'll probably come hit this beach again before I post this video. So I can hunt it out. <laughs> Tell Jordan about it. <laughs> but I think that's it for now. If anything else pops up, I'll let you guys know. There's a kid down here at the Melody Technic for the science project. We found a penny. Alright, I was hoping to catch some waves, but again, whenever I turn on my camera, it's bad timing. There's a boat out there docking on the pier. It's so crazy they do that here. All right, we're at home now and uh, gonna do the wrap up. Uh, we got uh, five dollars exactly in quarters, except not all five dollars here. One of them's over here. Cause look, it's a silver quarter. I didn't know I got it, and I went to three different beaches, so I don't know where I got it. But it's a 1938. Uh, I discovered it just uh, picking out my change, and it went clink in my hand. But it's a 1938 um, silver quarter. So I got five dollars and quarters, six nickels, ten, twenty, twenty-two dimes. I got five, ten, no, ten, twenty, thirty dollar, thirty pennies. Gosh, I can't speak right now. I got fishing weights. These little clip-on ones, they really slip through the scoop. I got some other junk. I got Spider-Man. I got, there's some of uh, my uh, real junk. Here's all my little targets. I got a key. I got a gold ring. <laughs> it is 14 karat gold. Finally, yay. Uh, I thought, ah, it's just probably just played it or something, you know. Nope, it's gold. The gold ring. I got another something. I don't know if you can see a little glint of gold in there on this side. Uh, that's definitely plated. I don't know what it is even. This is some kind of button. Uh, it's got the black onyx on it or blacks, whatever. And then I got this. Uh, oh, I never did look at this with the loop, but I'm pretty sure it's stainless steel. Got 11, 21, 13. And on this side it says R loves V. Robbie loves Vicky. Robert loves Vicky. Or Virginia. <laughs> I don't know. It's R loves V. Art Har V. Art R Heart V. Jeez, I really can't speak. Um that uh, turned into a good day. The first two spots I hit weren't very good. Although I did get the gold ring at one of them. But then to finish up, I really cleaned out on the change. Uh, that's more than I even thought I had. Um, look at that. There's a hundred dollars and quarters on this table. I counted them up because I was thinking about turning in my change. But I want to see how accurate the machine is. Oh, when I was going through these quarters, I saw this... Uh, like walking liberty thing flowing hair whatever I don't know I don't know the names of these old coins but it turns out it says France on the back so it tricked me I thought I had a good American quarter silver but it doesn't even seem like silver it's like light and it doesn't it's not right I was gonna look that up too but I forgot anyways there's a hundred bucks and quarters and here's the rest of the change 
and there's still more quarters in there plus I'm gonna add more plus I'm gonna add more to, from tomorrow's on it anyways that's it for this video goodbye and thanks for watching